that you're all here with us. Now, this is the people's house. And every day we kind of pinch ourselves that we, in fact, get to stay here. And sometimes in the mornings I'll sneak down and I kind of eat breakfast around the corner in the little breakfast nook over there. And I just find myself looking around, really wondering and imagining the conversations that have gone on here for 200 years. I mean, think about that. Just amazing. Um, so this home is uh, one of these places that I think uh, oftentimes it gets blended in with the spectacular buildings around Capitol Square. Um, many of you know this. It's, of course, the, the longest inhabited special, special purpose governor's residence in the nation. Um, I recently was visiting with Governor Larry Hogan, and he was bragging about his residence. And, uh, and I reminded him, I reminded him that his was, his was, his was new. <laughs> his was new. Um, I want to thank all of you for your amazing work that you do. And being new to all of this, one of the things I have enjoyed the most is watching our legislature. And you know, you see, what we see on TV all the time in Washington is so different than what happens here. And you all see it up close and personal. In Washington, they dump everything into one giant bill, fight over it, and nothing happens. <laughs> in Richmond, every issue gets its own bill. Every senator and every delegate does the work on that issue. And yes, they have help, but then they debate it in committee. And then they bring um, interested parties in to discuss yes or no. And then they debate it on the floor, many times on the floor. The Senate of Bill's heard three times before it's finally voted on. And the, to me, this is government at, at its best. And the wonderful thing, as I reminded our friends from the House and the Senate, is it does take three of us to get a bill done. And today I had, I had the great privilege of signing eight bills. Wow. Uh, that was really fun. There's a big stack book coming behind it because I know how hard everybody's so, really um, I, I want to thank all of you for your amazing support for this, for this entire process. And what's been fun to visit with all of you just a little bit is the blend of those of you that have been here for many years and have worked with delegates and senators worked with lots of delegates and lots of senators, and you have perspective. And those of you that are new, like me and Suzanne, <laughs> that are doing this for the first time, who probably wander around with just these wide eyes saying, isn't this amazing? And the blend of that is what makes this place so special. So I'm gonna thank all of you for all of your tremendous work. We do have 10 days of hard work in front of us, we all know that. Um, at least according to, to Delegate Knight and, uh, and, and Senator Howell, we will be done on the 12th. <laughs> By the way, you need to keep asking them that. <laughs> because they're the ones driving the schedule right now. Um, but again, Suzanne and I are just so honored you would join us this evening. Thank you. And I just so look forward to getting to the fifth floor or the seventh floor later this week. <laughs> God bless you all. I'm going to sneak out and go to a basketball game.